in the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful, to whom we all have to turn big. Honorable listeners and respectable audience, you know that we have commenced a series of linguistics. In linguistics, we commenced the chapter that is known as pragmatics. Pragmatics is the study of the use of language and context. Yesterday, I told you about presupposition. That presupposition means when a speaker uh, believes about something to be true in advance. That type of process is known as uh, presupposition. Listeners and items today, I am going to talk about the type of presupposition. There are six types of presupposition. Today, I am going to discuss only existential presupposition. What is existential presupposition and what are some examples of presupposition? Listeners and items, is, uh, it, uh, it is clear from the word existential. The word existential is talking about the existence of a thing. That's something which exists. So now, what is existential presupposition? Existential presupposition means it is the assumption of the speaker about something to exist. I'm repeating. Existential presupposition is the assumption of the existence of the entities named by the speaker. That kind of assumption is called existential presupposition. In other words, when a speaker assumes that something exists, that assumption about the existence of a thing, of an, of an entity, it's called existential presupposition. For example, let me provide some examples uh, for clarification. One example is, for example, Aslam placed the cup. Aslam placed the cup on the table. Listeners and ideas, this is an utterance, a statement. Aslam placed the cup on the table. Now, what is the presupposition of this utterance? Definitely, the presupposition of this utterance is that cup is an entity which exists. The table is an entity which exists. So here, the speaker assumes that the cuff is an entity which exists and the table is an entity which exists. Another example, another example, for example, Aslam, Aslam's new car. Aslam's new car. Now, what is the pre uh, existential presupposition of this utterance? Definitely the speaker or the listener, he will uh, presuppose, he will presuppose that, uh, what? Aslam is an entity and who has a car. So Aslam exists and the car exists. So this is the existential uh, presupposition of the Aslam's new car. That Aslam uh, has, Aslam is an entity, he has a car. So Aslam also exists, exists and car also. Hope that this topic is clear to you.